Hello Vikings and Shield Maidens, uh, welcome back to some more Mountain Blade Viking Conquest. Well, hello there, Vesex. I've I missed you. <laughs> my my fucking Vikings have as well. <laughs> oh, look at that, 140 Huskars, man, 112 heresies. I'm actually just uh, trading Huskars uh, for, for this very opportunity. I was kind of hoping that this uh, kind of ceasefire or calm moment would kind of pass soon because I really want to get my hands on this city because that means I will be like the blah 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 over Britain. I need Unsmoon, Seradif and Bonsweg and Bonsweg is the only place I don't own as you guys probably know by now. So it's gonna be interesting to see what happens. Haha, <laughs> first castle taken, and it is Snottingham. I don't know if you guys remember this, but yeah, it's... I, you do say snot right, like mucus from the nose. I'm not quite sure. Is that only like a Swedish thing? I don't really know. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, uh, it uh, wasn't too bad, the actual assault went really well, but placing the ladders and that kind of stuff costed me like 35 dead, hopefully not too many good men. Uh, let's see, who the hell do we give this to? Oh, he already has so much. Man, I'm afraid it's gonna be so much fucking rebellion, man. <laughs> I was starting to like... Regret, let's see, 33, actually we lost 7 Huskars to deaths and 4 nobles, that kind of sucked, but uh, we still have a pretty damn big force, so should easily be able to take over a couple of more castles before we have to regroup. And there goes castle number 2, I don't even know what it's named, because I don't give a fuck, it's just all going to be mine. My precious. Fuck, I, I hate how they put up this system though. Like, honestly, I don't fucking need my lords. They're, most of them are completely goddamn useless. I mean, sure, it's it's hard to like fight off everything by yourself, but most of the time I'm doing all the fucking work, it feels like. My lords just end up being stupid and being captured. But I should make like 40,000 more panning at or something like that. But because the game doesn't like that, uh, I'm like forced to give them to my fucking lords and shit that will probably just betray me and... God damn it, man. I, I don't know, like, am I doing shit wrong? Why, why does all my lords hate me? Like, do I really have to go and ask everybody all the goddamn time who they think should get a castle? Like, I can't be fucking bothered with that. I'm trying to kill some fucking Irishmen and shit, okay? <laughs> <laughs> I just love this. <laughs> ran into two or three of their lords just randomly. Luckily, I had a fucking huge force like you saw previously ca for capturing a bunch of different uh, castles at once. And uh, first battle, about 1,000 enemy troops slain versus about 50 dead for me though, sadly. Quite a lot of uh, Huskars and similar died and, and Irish champions. Uh, but both of their, uh, or both of them or all three of the enemy lords died. So this is how they're attacking. They're attacking like bandits. Just a huge fucking mob. Not like put up in nice neat lines or nothing. Oh man, it's just such a fucking slaughter. Hopefully we can capture one of these dicks. Oh yay! First guy out of two captured. Oh, both captured! Nice! Plus we freed a friendly. Not too bad for a day's work, I would say. Not too bad. Mm, feels good, man. <laughs> That's another castle captured. I would like to go through these men and pick out the best both worthy to sell for slavery, but honestly, I can't, I can't really be bothered anymore. I just wanna... I just wanna wreck faces and become the fucking king of England. The king of the world. <laughs> so that is, uh, let's see here now, who should we give that to? Fuck, yeah, uh, 42 minus, I don't think he's gonna... Fuck, there's so many with 100 minus, man. That guy, I guess, fuck it. Never mind. Oh, yeah, three castles down and two lords. Uh, beautiful, beautiful, I guess. Maybe I should take Oxenfurt before. Now I'm gonna go and drop off some of the slaves, or soon to be slaves. And another castle is taken. However, it was costly. Holy crap, man. We got 24 champions dead. A uh, bunch of archers, 13 Huskars dead. Nobles, 10 dead. 56 dead in total. They had 444 dudes in this castle and it was just 
It was nasty difficult to fucking take. I believe this is the one right underneath Nottingham or whatever the heck it's called. Let's let's see here. Let's just grab the loot real quick and see what the heck kind of a place this is. We need to definitely go and sell some of this crap. Starting to get a full inventory. Want quite a lot of battles. Uh, let's give it to him. Fuck, we can't afford him to fucking leave us. <laughs> Minus 28. It's Oxenford. So, Oxenford? I, I don't know. Uh, anyways, that's it. So, we're kind of looking good now. Vesex is shrinking, but uh, we had 40 whose cars and we had 40 nobles when I set out to take this place. <laughs> and after a couple of battles and taking this place, eh, we need to fall back and get a little bit more troops, I believe. <laughs> I just realized that these guys have two port cities, London and uh, Dunvik. So I think we're gonna take those and then finish off with these two castles. Uh, then this castle and then ship and hum and just work our way, so to say. Fuck man, I can't believe this. They actually have six cities. Damn. Still. <laughs> they, they are a force to be reckoned with. One, two, three, four. Oh, five cities. They're actually the second biggest one. I think only I have more. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I got seven. <laughs> Soon to be eight, bitches. Let's do this. Oh, yes. Looking like a good start. Two dead. And uh, we already debarked. Eleven wounded, though. But uh, almost a hundred dead and wounded for them right now. So, uh, looking damn good. They already got their first reinforcement because we're slaughtering them. Like dogs or something. I don't know. Oh, come on. Why would people slaughter dogs? Maybe they taste good. I, I, I shouldn't judge. Fuck, I eat cows and shit. People might have cows as pets. Shouldn't be so narrow-minded, Anders. S still, though, I, I mean, I'd probably eat dog if I was offered dog. But I, I, I would probably never, like, buy dog, though, if you know what I mean. To eat. <laughs> that would just be weird. At least in my opinion. Oh, crap. Okay, they're kind of coming all around, so we're gonna try to sneak behind them, kind of like I've done before with the leads. Hopefully we can make that happen. Manage to sneak my champions around, my Irishmen, and uh, the enemy doesn't really realize what's going on yet. Some of them are, but the rest are busy finding my Huskars. And the Huskars are just fucking great for close combat kind of stuff. What the fuck are you guys? Oh, shit! <laughs> the enemy's coming from a little bit of all kinds of directions now because we moved our men. So we're kind of pathfinding it differently. Ah, never mind. Let's start chopping these guys up in the back. This should be an easy win. This is like their second reinforcement already. Yeah, they're down 300 men, so they only have half left. Excellent. This old city, which have never left the Vesex. Uh, occupation? Or, or owning? Or... Fuck it. D d Okay, no one has owned it except them for like five years and years. It's time for Viking rule, bitches. You will like Viking rule. Booze for everybody. Women for everybody. If, if the women agree. Except if there's maybe enemy win a moon. I can't even speak, man. I'm getting all excited for all these enemy women, man. <laughs> I'm fucking weird. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. I don't know why. I'm just fucking weird. There we go, Dunwick is under Viking rule. Yeah, bitches. Let's go to London. Nu jävla får dansken smaka svensk kuk. <laughs> oh, no, I, I mean, <laughs> no, Vesex is, is getting wrecked, okay? <laughs> the, total did not speak shit about the Danish, okay? Danish people, it's, it's cool. It's cool, I like you. I kind of like you. I'm lying. No one likes the Danish. Dans jävla... Fucking Skåne too! <laughs> I don't know where this hostility is coming from, I'm, I'm so sorry, I'm a, I'm a racist big- Oh god, fucking damn it, I got knocked unconscious! <laughs> I guess I deserve that, though, shit. I don't know how many extra men I lost because of that. But it's, it's fucked up, this port is fucked up as hell. Uh, like London or Londonburg or whatever they call it here. Because, like, the, the ships don't actually, like, fit. 
So, like, if I try to go first, it takes forever before anyone gets to go anywhere. Uh, so I'm gonna let that guy pass me like a good Swedish guy standing in kö, you know? Uh, that's like stand in line. We, we we do stand in line like bosses in Sweden, though, I gotta say. It's like, I've, I've been to a lot of countries now, like 10 plus countries, and there's no country that is as civilized and stand in queue as good as Swedish people, okay? Like, you all, you all need to take a page out of the Swedish stay in line book, okay? Motherfuckers, uncivilized bastards. <laughs> I'm joking, okay? I'm joking. <laughs> oh, this should be a pretty easy win. All of them are, are like really crappy bowmen. Mmm, that is good. I can I can make my blade sharper on your teeth. <laughs> Excellent. Cut them in two. I, oh, by the way, also, I, I realized that this is actually an Ulfberg sword. Uh, this is the best kind of sword you can actually have during the Viking Age, like any country in the world. Because the steel was bought from like Iraq or Iran or something, where they could like get a, a really clean and good steel that would pick up carbon really well, or iron maybe I should say, that could pick up carbon really well and become very good steel in the very hot uh, Mas Ungnar, as we had here in Sweden, or basically like big furnaces where you like heat up the iron and, and mix in the coal and, and whatnot. But yeah, uh, so so th thanks to actually Ar Arabic like iron slash steel, we managed to make those Ulfberg swords that were like, even better than samurai swords, even better uh, back then. And and some of you might be like, "Yeah, you're full of shit." But I've read this, okay? I've read this in newspapers. This this is supposed to be true. They they were. Harder to break, uh, but they were ridiculously expensive. Not as ridiculously expensive like some of the samurai swords, though, I was told. Um, holy fuck, I went on a rant, didn't I? Oh, never mind. <laughs> it's all mine. It is m Oh. I actually have ten towns. So, eleven towns now. Hell! What? Wait, 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 what? What the hell is going on here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. Holy shit, my math is so bad. Wait, did I get to eleven? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten. Oh, eleven! Shit, I forgot about that one up there. <laughs> That's why I think my math was still off though, by by at least like one place. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, all Swedish people are not as dumb as I am. Okay, okay. <laughs> But yeah, we're 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 getting some some shit here. Uh, I just need to get some troops to put in here, though. <laughs> well, shit, me has declared war. Hmm. I'm thinking about just going and taking their shit first, but uh, I think I'm gonna stick with Wessex though and try trying to get them good. Dominic is actually under siege. Oh wait. Oh, Lundvik is under siege as well. I guess because I left so very little troops in them. That's at least my personal guess. Whoa. Unsmoon has... Whoa! Well, crap on a cracker. Shit is going on everywhere. Okay, this is getting interesting. I mean, I got troops for at least a couple of more hard-fought battles, but uh, things are getting tough. But it's okay. Anders doesn't quit when the going gets tough. Anders gets mad! Oh, well, shit! Me conquering most of XX definitely got people interested. Fries, I believe those are the guys on the coast next to Denmark, actually. So that's kind of interesting. Uh, about to take this castle here. Should be easy peasy. What the fuck? Norway has declared war on me as well now! Holy shit, this is ridiculous! What the fuck? Okay, I think that's gonna be it for this episode. Holy crap. As always, thank you guys so very much for watching. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.